If anyone tells you that prayer is easy, he has lied to you. If anyone tells you that, you know me, I enjoy praying. No, no. They are not telling you the complete truth. Nobody always enjoys praying. That's why the Bible says, as a good soldier of Christ, endure hardship. You must endure praying. You know? Sometimes you have to endure reading the Bible. Have you noticed that it is sweeter for you to Facebook than to read the Bible? When you want to Facebook, you are okay, you are normal. You can Facebook until 2 a.m. But once you pick up the Bible, 10 minutes your eyes are closing. Why? It is a struggle between the flesh and the spirit. So you must endure hardship. When you endure, it becomes a natural part of you. I remember in those days, I would ask my sons, let's go to the mountain. They think I wanted to pray. In the flesh, I didn't want to pray. But I had to obey the spirit. I would tell them, let's go to the mountain and pray. And when I go, I say, and they say, wow. Papa is always in the spirit. They didn't know. <laughs> they thought I was always in the spirit, brother. Sometimes when I began praying, I, I felt like running away. I felt like, what is this? There are times you start praying, no connection. You don't feel anything. But then as you persist and follow the spirit, oh, there will be an adjustment. All of a sudden, you receive a breakthrough in your spirit and you break through the flesh. And before you know it, boom, you are there. And all of a sudden, you feel energy. You begin to receive visions. You feel the power of God. Even Jesus, the Bible says, in the days of his flesh, he lifted up his voice and cried. Why? Because prayer was difficult. Enduring was difficult. Staying in the presence of God was difficult. So in the days of his flesh, he had to push by crying. He had to push the flesh. Don't do lazy prayer. You are in the days of your flesh. You are not in the days of, you are not in heaven yet. You are in the flesh. So the flesh will want to resist you from seeking the face of God. And that's why sometimes you need to be crazy. Ah, no. Yeah. I am teaching you spiritual discipline. Endure hardship. You are a good soldier. Endure. When you endure, you will enjoy. I see that grace for persistence coming upon you in the name of Jesus. I am in the scriptures. God took me to the Bible. I saw the story of Joseph. I don't know why I keep hearing Joseph, Yusuf. I saw yes, the story of Joseph. That is my brother. Yusuf. Yes, sir. I see the Lord saying, Petrus, who is Petrus? That is my father. Your father. Celebrate Jesus, somebody. But you are the one God is talking to here. You know, Joseph had a dream. He saw two people. One, a baker. Be baker. Yes, sir. I'm working in bakery. You are working in a bakery. Celebrate Jesus. Before. Yes, sir. Just the way God elevated Joseph. And that baker, for the butler, God is lifting you up. Amen. Yusuf is your brother. Yes, sir. God is changing his story. Amen. The Lord said you went through a lot of sufferings, a lot of trouble, but he's going to change your story forever. Amen. You have undergone sufferings, but the Lord said he's turning your story around for good. Amen. The battles are over.